Hey guys, thanks for clicking on this video. So today we're actually going to go to the zoo. We're going to see the other half of the zoo that we didn't get to see last time we were there. And we thought this week what we really wanted to do was give you guys some advice and tips on how to get kids to keep their mask on. We actually have a, a three-year-old that just turned four and a 12-year-old with autism that is getting ready to turn 13. Both of them will keep their mask on in public generally without any complaint. So if you keep watching this video, we're going to give you our best advice on to how to do the same with your kids. Of people are very opinionated over masks right now whether or not they work whether or not they're useful whether or not the kids should have to wear them however i'm not really here to debate that in this video we're just going to give you advice on how to get your kids to keep their mask on yesterday in ohio the governor just announced that children in school k through 12 are all required to wear a mask and we're not sure if that affects Jesse and his special needs school or if that affects Olivia in preschool but either way we wanted to give you guys some really good advice on how to keep your kids wearing masks so before we go to the zoo I'm gonna give you tip number one and that is lead by example and that doesn't just mean wearing a mask in front of your kids when you're in public that also means to set a good positive example. So when you put the mask on, don't make it a bad thing. Don't complain about wearing the mask. Don't let your kids hear you talk about the mask being unnecessary, not needed, uncomfortable, anything of that nature. Your kids hear you and they're gonna pick up on what you're doing. So if you have a negative attitude towards wearing a mask, they're going to as well. So my best, biggest piece of advice I'm gonna give you first is lead by example. You know, your kids are already complaining about it. They've already heard you complaining about it. That's okay. It's okay to, to change about that. And you can teach your kids that the masks are comfortable, are easy to breathe out of, that it's not that hard, even in the heat. We're going to the zoo today. It's gonna be 80 degrees outside and the kids are still gonna be wearing the mask the entire time. Okay. So I am going to bring both our Disney mask and our doctor's office mask. Regular masks. Yeah, so I think they're both comfortable to breathe out of and I've, we've been to the zoo with these. So I know the kids won't have any issues with these. These, um pull on Olivia's ears like up just a little bit so we're gonna bring these ones too just to have one of each in case one gets uncomfortable we have one that we definitely know is comfortable to wear so I think that's a definitely an important step is to make sure that the masks are comfortable and fit properly mm -hmm. guys ready to go to the zoo yeah! Yay! and they look super busy today Olivia, put your mask on. Ready? I know, it's really bright out here. We'll put your sunglasses on too and make sure that's out of your eyes. And your sunglasses. There, good? We have sunscreen on, we have our mask on, we are ready to go. Hey Jesse, what? Why do we have to wear a mask? Because of Corona. I think it's important for kids to know why they have to do something and that everybody has to do it. Even if you see other people not doing it, you still have to do it, huh? Mm -hmm. Yep. All right, let's go. This might end up being a shorter trip this time. Mm -hmm. There was a lot more people today. There's 
smaller than I remember. They are very talkative today, aren't they, Olivia? My mask is fogging up my glasses with my breath. The mask does fog up the glasses. That is what happens. I like to set my glasses kind of on top of them a little more and pull the mask up a little higher. And then put your glasses kind of on top of it. And that'll help. Is that better? Mm -hmm. Okay. I would say like 30% of adults are not wearing masks. Yeah. 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 A lot of, most of the kids are not wearing masks, but like 30% of the adults. Yeah. Jesse, we're not going to go into the reptile exhibit because there are, it's an indoor there exhibit. are too many people in here to but go to the indoor exhibit. But there's one reptile that we can see. Alligator. alligator. Right there behind that rock. Just lay in there. You want to move on? Don't like the alligator? Are you excited? Yeah. yeah we're gonna, what are we going to do? Go up. The carousel. Yay! So there is one guy working and he has to wipe down each carousel before they let the next riders on. Only the outside ones. Only the outside yeah, ones. Yeah, they're only doing the outside carousels. You can't do the second or third one. Nope, none of the other two. Here we We're gonna go see the apes and monkeys and gorillas. Uh -huh. Right, Jesse? Yep. Was that so much fun? Yeah. Yeah. And I love carousels. You love carousels? That was so much fun, wasn't it? Yeah. Now remember, don't touch our faces. Okay. Right, Jesse? Wait, wait, wait. Jesse's bad about touching his face and he's a lot. Lots of reminders not to touch his face and mask. Right? I right. just touched right. my mask. That's okay, okay, honey. We just need to not touch it. We'll give you lots of reminders. What are they doing? Laying down. Do you know that a group of kangaroos is called a mob? Yes, yes, I did. I did know that. <laughs> Uh, Don't touch your glasses and your face, sweetheart. I see him. You see the koala? Yeah. Do you like him? Mm -hmm. Don't close. touch your face. He's sleeping in his house. Yeah. He is sleeping in his house, isn't he? So we're going to go on the boat rides, and because there's a little mist, we're going to all change out to the cloth mask. That way we'll have these extra masks. That these are masks the nice and dry when we come back. And these masks. So we are getting ready to go on the boat ride. Change out our mask. Mm -hmm. And it looks like they're doing one family per boat. That's what we're hoping for. What? Why are the pelicans so big? Because they're right. pelicans? Just so you guys know. That's cool that they just clean the boats yeah. after you get off and then you get in the next one. Yeah. So every other one. That's very smart. No touching your face, Jesse. I know, Matt. My bottom's wet. <laughs> this yeah. seat's wet. Well, not this one right here. It's just a little, like in the back, like in the corner. It's like that one. You have to do. You ready, Olivia? It's gonna be so much fun. You ready? Mhm. Mm so every family does have their own bow. Are you ready? Here we go. 
pump pump? Where are you steering? I am not steering, you're steering. Jesse, you're not steering? Who's steering then? Jesse has driven us into the wall twice. No, I have not. I, there's no steering wheel. He has. No, I haven't. There's no steering wheel. He said something about an iceberg and driving right into it. I don't know what he's talking about. No, it's the two. Look at that. I bet Jesse's the first one to jump. Hey, Who that? Monkeys. You see the monkeys? The boat ride's fun, isn't it, Olivia? So far, so far Jesse? Oh, wow. Look at that. keeping the mask on. Don't let it be optional. Last time we were here, Jesse kept saying it was hot and he wanted to take his mask off. And we told him that if he took his mask off, we were going home, that it wasn't an option. So everyone enjoy their boat ride. Yeah. yeah, that was so much fun. Oh, she's, she's enjoying it now. Oh, good, good. You're enjoying it? As a pet. It's a leopard. You see the leopard? So cute. Yeah. It's like, yeah, so cute. You know, so I can't get in there. Olivia, what's it look like? Has me a toy. She just said mommy's shoes. Mommy shoes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I added in her bows. Yeah. No. Leopard. Leopard. Well, now he's cleaning it. Yeah. Oh, look. Here's a big one. Yeah. He is. He's getting a dream. Yeah. Do they have tails? No. Then what are they? Gorillas? Eight. Eight. If it doesn't have a tail, it's not a monkey. Did you learn nothing from Veggie Tails? Here they come, Olivia. Look at them. They're coming over to say hi. Oh, my that is the cutest little duck. I love the blue. I don't know what the baby dog doing. It is playing in the water. That duck is so funny. That duck is so funny. <laughs> One of the most important things to remember with the mask are consistency. Be consistent all the time, every time. No giving in. No, you can take it off for a little bit. Be consistent. Set expectations for them to wear their masks and they'll meet them.
Yes, the cheetahs are a lot bigger than last time we were here. Uh -huh. What? Yeah, they're getting big. Oh, Look, here they go. Yes, definitely a lot bigger. They're getting so big already. Yes, they are. Because they're grown like Madeline grew. Can you see them? They're about the size of Madeline. I swear they're twice the size. Uh, yeah, they are. Yeah. No big deal? No big deal. All right, we're in the car. Finally gonna take our mask off. Yeah. Yeah. Yay. All right. Jesse, yeah. like how do you feel about wearing your mask? It's okay. It's okay, isn't it? Mm-hmm. It's not that bad. Nope. Nope. Hardest part is what? Mm, not touching my face. That's right. Not touching your face, that's the hardest part. We're doing a good job. Any advice for other kids that don't want to wear their mask? Me. Olivia, what's your advice? Uh, be outside. It's good advice. Playing out, playing outside. Jesse, um. what's your advice? Wear a mask you can breathe through it and it doesn't get overheated. That's really good advice. Best advice, summary, wearing the mask. Lead a good example. Don't be negative and criticizing it. Consistency is key. Make sure they're having to wear it all the time, every time. Find one that's comfortable and cover and it still covers for your face that's breathable and not too thick. Yeah. yeah. Do it long enough, they'll get used to it. The kids will rise to your expectations. They can do it, and you can do it. Right, kiddos? Wait. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog and you learned something about masks and that you guys are feeling a lot more confident with your kids wearing masks, just like ours. Mm -hmm. Wore mask. Uh -huh the entire time without absolutely incomplete. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Click on this video. Will you please click on this video? Come on, push it. Can you please subscribe? Can you please push that subscribe button? Or for the other video, just go and press this button. Go on, click this button. Or this button, or this button. Well, mostly this button, but these two buttons are